Hi there, I'm Jala Gupta, physiotherapist, specialist in orthopedics. Today I'm going to tell you the various knee exercises that you can do anywhere and anytime. It is not related to your meals, you can do while sleep, before sleeping and after waking up. So these exercises can be done by youngsters, by children, by geriatric population. My main purpose of this exercise is to tell these exercises that people who are having already having arthritis can start out with these exercises yes if you're a severe case and you require surgery that is a different case so after surgery you have to start out with the exercises but better is if you are functional and you are able to do your activities of daily living so the i would recommend that not to go for the surgery instead do the exercises because arthritis cannot be cured but obviously you can slow down the progression of the arthritis so why not start it today if you're not doing it so see for example you have two options in case of surgeries whenever either you are functional fully functional you are just having slight pain and you want to go for a surgery so don't offer a surgery because you can cure yourself with the exercises you can stop and slow down the progression of osteoarthritis say for example there are two options one is that you have to undergo a surgery in which all your muscles will be cut down and then they will reach your bone level that's obvious then after that your muscle will be stitched so you will be reaching from zero or one level to five and another scenario is in which your muscle strength is already three by five or four by five and you have to reach five by five which one is better obviously from three to five is much better rather than jumping from 0 to 5 or 1 to 5. So advisable is if you can cure yourself with the exercises and if not then obviously surgery is the result for you. So I'm going to teach you the easy level exercises for the knee joint which won't harm you and in case of sprains, strains or just whenever we the pains are idiopathic when we don't know that why the pain actually is happening like sometimes we are sitting in a chair and doing an office work and we think okay why I feel a click sound in my knee when I stand up so that's because we have to train the vastus medialis obliquus muscle that is the main muscle that we have to train that whenever we straighten our knee whenever we do the extension of the knee joint it get it is weakened so we have to strain the vestus medialis obliquus along with the quadriceps and the hamstrings so starting out with the first exercise just lie down comfortably i'm lying down comfortably and you have to slide your knee so while sliding your knee take care that you are pressing your heel down to the floor then you are sliding your knee so how you're going to slide your knee is press down vertically apply pressure pressure slide 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 this way you're going to slide again apply pressure down and slide 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 so my i'm applying continuous pressure on my knee joint and my foot is back like this it's not like this it's like this apply a pressure down and continuously keep sliding while applying a pressure so repeat it 10 times from both the knees do not do the exercise only with one knee joint right even if one is affected strengthen both the knees because later on your the good one will also get affected right so the other exercise is in whichever angle you are having pain apart from that angle say for example i'm having pain at this angle so i'll press my knee at this angle just press your heel down and count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten change the angle and press one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so continuously my heel is in this position dorsiflexion position again change the angle and press one two three four five six seven eight nine ten as long as you are straightening your knee and then pressing you are training your vastus medialis obliquus because this muscle acts 
it helps in straightening your knee right so the other exercise is while lying down just make a toggle roll and place it below your knee you have to do it while lying down like this right and in this position just press the toggle down with your foot back like this press down with your foot back hold one two three four five six seven eight nine ten relax press the toggle down foot back hold one two three four five six seven eight nine ten relax so this exercise is for training of the vmo the vastus medialis obliquus muscle press the foot down on the toggle press the heel press the sorry knee down on the toggle and relax press down and relax just mind that your hip do not lift up right while you're applying force with your knee joint press the toggle down and relax and your foot should remain in this position okay the next exercise is that place the toggle below your heel right in line position and then press it down again vertically down heel should press vertically down where your foot is in front press 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 relax again press vertically down 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 relax press vertically down 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 relax so this is the third exercise that you are going to do it well the fourth exercise is that you are just going to you know you're not going to slide your leg or do anything just keep your both knees like this and with the both knees apply pressure downwards one two three four five relax again apply pressure down one two three four five relax apply pressure down one two three four five apply pressure down relax so this exercise you are going to do 10 times 10 sets recommended two times a day when the other exercise 